of a trinomial. The square of trinomial consists of the sum of the squares of the first, second, and last terms, twice the product of the first and the second terms, twice the product of the first and last terms, and twice the product of the second and the last terms. Okay, the product of, of square of trinomial consists of six terms. Okay, to find the product, we have a pattern. Okay, yung first term natin is first term is squared. Then ating second term is second term is squared. Then third term is third term squared. Then ating fourth term is two times first term times second term or twice the product of first term and second term. So, yung ating fifth term is twice the product of first term and third term. Or, so, yung ating sixth term is twice the product of second term and third term. Okay? So, let's have an example. We have example number one. We have a quantity of A plus B plus C squared. Okay? So, ang ating first term dito is A. Yung ating second term is B. Ang ating third term is C. Okay. So, following the pattern. Okay? So, unahin natin yung first term. Yung ating first term is first term squared. Okay, ang ating first term dito is A. So, A squared. Okay. So, ang ating second term is second term squared. So, is square natin yung second term. Ito yung second term natin, yung B. So, we have B squared. Next, yung third term natin is, is squared din natin yung third term. So, we have C squared. Okay, next, ang ating fourth term is twice the product of first term and second term. So, we have 2 times yung first term natin is A times yung second term natin is B. Okay? Okay, yung fifth term natin is twice the product of first term and third term. So, we have 2. Yung first term natin is a Okay, yung third term natin is C Okay So, dito sa sixth term is Twice the product of second term and third term Okay, we have two Yung second term natin is B Okay, and third term natin is C Okay, now a times A. A squared is equal to A times A. Yung B squared natin is B times B. Yung C squared natin is equal to C times C. Okay? Multiply muna natin yung first term and second terms. We have two. Okay. A times B is equal to AB. Okay? Again, multiply natin yung first term and third term. We have 2. A times C is equal to AC. Okay? Yung sixth term natin is, again, multiply natin yung second term and third term. We have 2 times B times C is equal to BC. Okay, next is A times A. Using the product rule, we add natin yung exponent. So, we have one exponent here. Then 1. So, 1 plus 1 is equal to A squared. Next is B times B is we have B squared. Next is C times C is equal to C squared. Next, 2 times AB is equal to 2AB. Next, 2 times AC is equal to 2AC. 
Next is 2 times BC is equal to 2 BC. Okay, to sum it up, we have, ang ating answer is, is equal to ito. Yung first term natin is A squared plus B squared plus C squared plus 2AB plus 2AC plus 2 BC. Okay, this is now our answer. Okay? Okay, example number 2. We have 2x plus 3y minus 6 squared. Okay? Yung first term natin is 2x. Yung second term natin is 3y. Ang yung third term natin is negative 6 is equal to... Okay, using the pattern, we have... Ang ating first term is first term squared. So, yung first term natin is 2x. Okay. 2x squared natin. Yung ating second term is second term squared. We have... Yung second term natin is 3y squared. Okay, yung third term is, is squared natin, negative 6 squared. Okay, negative 6 squared. Next is, yung fourth term natin is 2 multiplied first term and second term. Ating first term is 2x. 2x. Then, ating second term is 3y. Okay, next, ang ating fifth term is we have 2 times first term. We have 2x, ang ating first term. Ang ating third term times third term is negative 6. We have negative 6. Next, the sixth term natin is 2 times second term. Ang ating second term is 3y times third term, negative 6. Negative 6. Okay? Next is, um, 2x squared is equal to 2x times 2x. Okay, yung 3y squared is equal to 3y times 3y. Okay, negative 6 squared is equal to negative 6 times negative 6. Okay, next is, multiply muna natin yung first term and second term. So, copy natin yung 2 times 2x times 3y is 3 times 2 is equal to 6. 6 x times y is equal to xy. 6xy. Next, multiply naman natin yung first term and yung third term. So, copy the 2. Okay. 2x times negative 6. Okay, negative 6 times 2 is equal to negative 12 x Okay, next is ang ating sixth term. Multiply muna natin yung second term into third term. Okay, 3y times negative 6 is equal to negative 18. Okay, negative 18y. Okay, 2x times 2x is equal to 4 okay x times x we have so x times x is we have x squared so 4x squared dito naman 3y times 3y 3 times 3 equals 9 y times y y squared okay we have negative 6 times negative 6 okay negative times negative we have positive 36 Next is 2 times 6 12 Okay, 2 times 6xy So we have 12xy Next is 2 times negative 12x 
So negative 12 times 2 is equal to negative 24x. Next is negative 18 times 2 or 2 times negative 18y. We have negative 36y. Okay. So our answer of 2x plus 3y minus 6 squared is equal to, we have first term natin is 4x, 4x squared plus 9y squared plus 36 plus 12xy plus minus 24x minus 36 why okay this is now our answer okay, next we have cube of a binomial okay the product consists of four terms when you see cube of binomial we have x plus y cube or x plus y times x plus y times x plus y. This is our expanded form. So, I think x plus y is cube. Okay? Okay. Also, we have x minus y cube or x minus y times x minus y times x minus y. Okay? So, to get, to find the product of the cube of binomial, we have also a pattern. So, I think first term is, first term is cube. Then, I think second term is 3 times first term squared times second term. And I think third term is 3 times first term times second term squared. And I think fourth term is second term cube. Okay? We have example here, number 1. Example. Okay, we have x plus y cube. Okay? Yung x natin, ito yung first term. And y, ito yung second term. Okay. Using the pattern, okay, we will start from the first term. So, first term cube, ang first term is x. We have x cube. Ang ating second term is, okay, okay, three times yung first term. First term is x squared times second term. Yung second term natin is y. Okay? Yung third term natin is 3 times first term is x. Ating second term is y squared natin yung second term. Okay? Ating fourth term is second term cube. Ating second term is y so we have y cube. Okay. So x cube is equal to x times x times x. Okay, next is um multiply muna natin yung first term and second term. Okay? So x squared times y is equal to we have 3x squared y. Okay? Next is, uh, multiply din natin yung first term and second term. So, x times y squared is equal to xy squared. Okay? y cubed is equal to y times y times y. Okay, next is x times x times x since meron itong exponent na 1. So, 1 plus 1 plus 1, we have x cubed. Again, 3 times x squared y is equal to 3x squared y. Next is 3 times xy squared is equal to 3x y squared 
Okay, next is y times y times y is equal to y cube. So our answer of x plus y cube is equal to I think first term is x cube and I think second term is 3x squared y and I think third term is 3xy squared and I think fourth term is y cube. So uh, I think answer is x cube plus 3x squared y plus 3xy squared then plus y cube. Okay, this is now our answer. Okay, we have example number two, the cube of a binomial. We have 3x minus 2y cube. Okay, so ang ating first term dito is 3x and ating second term is 2 or negative 2y. Okay, using the pattern, ang ating first term is first term cube. Okay, yung first term natin is 3x. We have a cube natin yung first term. So, 3x cube. Next is, ang ating second term is 3. Okay, 3 times uh, first term squared. Ang first term natin is 3x. 3x squared times second term. Yung second term natin is negative 2y. Okay? So, ang ating third term is 3 3 times first term. Yung first term natin is 3x. Times second term, negative 2y. 2y squared. Squared natin yung second term. Okay, ang ating third, uh, fourth term is second term cube. Ang ating second term is negative 2y. 2y cube. Okay. So, okay, 3x cubed is equal to 3x times 3x times 3x. Okay, next is um, 3, ito yung substitute muna natin yung exponent, 3 times, okay, 3 squared, then x squared times negative 2y okay so I think third term is 3 times 3x next is, is substitute muna natin yung squared dito sa ating second term we have negative 2 squared next is y squared okay yung third term natin is negative 2y cubed is equal to negative 2y times negative 2y times negative 2y okay so 3x 3x times 3x times 3x okay 3 times 3 is equal to 9 9 times 3 is equal to 27 we have 27x okay Using the product rule, i-add natin yung exponent. We have 1, 2, 3. X cube. Okay. Sa ating second term, um, copy 3. So, 3 times squared, or 3 times 3, or 3 squared is equal to 3 times 3. Okay. 3 times 3 is equal to 9. X squared times negative... 2y Okay Next, ang ating fourth, third term is Okay, copy 3x 3 times 3x Okay Negative 2 squared or negative 2 times negative 2 is equal to positive 4 Then y squared Okay Sa ating second term or sa ating fourth term we have 
negative 2y times negative 2y times negative 2y. Okay, negative 2 times negative 2 is equal to positive 4. Okay, positive 4 times negative 2 is equal to negative 8. Okay, y times y times y. So, we have y cubed. Okay, next. Okay. So, we have 27x cubed. Okay, so I think second term. 9 times 3 is equal to 27. Okay. 27 times negative 2 is equal to negative 54. Negative 54. Okay, yung variable natin is x squared. Then we have y. Okay, so I think third term, I have 3 times 3 is equal to 9x. Okay, 9x times 4 is equal to 36, positive 36. Okay, variable natin is x, then y squared. Okay, so we have, I think first term is 2, 27 x cubed and I think second term is negative 54 x squared y and I think third term is 36 x y squared and I think fourth term is negative 8 y cubed so ang ating answer dito sa x dito sa 3 x minus 2 y cubed is equal to 27 x cubed minus 54 x squared y plus 36 xy squared then negative 8y cube okay this is now our answer okay thank you so much guys for watching my video i hope that you've learned a lot on special products under the special product which is square of a binomial product of a sum and difference of a two terms square of a trinomial and cube of a binomial thank you so much guys please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell